Today we are talking omega-3s, which are essential fatty acids, so like vitamins, which are essential nutrients. And as you will see, omega-3s are essential building blocks of cells and are helpful for improving things such as the heart and inflammation throughout the body. Something you need to know about if you're a runner. As always, the more you know, the faster you run. Let's take a look at the chemistry. Okay, so the first question is why are they called omega-3s? And the reason for that comes down to naming convention in chemistry. So this is a, a picture of DHA and EPA, which are the two most important omega-3s. And they each have on one end this acid group, and we call this from the Greek the alpha end. And so the other end, the end of the chain, is called the omega end from Greek. So alpha beginning, omega end. And if you count back one carbon, two carbon, three carbon, that is when the first double bond appears. So the name omega-3 is simply the naming, the naming convention for these type of, of molecules. Now, the reason you take omega-3s, in my mind, is actually one of the most practical things. So if you want to hit your recommended daily allowance of omega-3s every day, what that looks like is eating three servings of fish per week. Now, most people I know aren't eating three servings per, of fish per week. It just doesn't happen. And so the other more practical, easy way to make sure you're getting sufficient supply of omega-3s is simply by taking, you know, one omega-3 supplement every single day, which becomes the equivalent of eating three servings of fish per week. Very practical. And the reason you need omega-3s in the body split into what I consider essential reasons and then helpful reasons. Now, essential reasons are just like calcium helps build strong bones, you need omega-3s to really help developing the, the fat that creates the central nervous system, the, um, a lot of the tissues that are developed in the brain. So this is why that you often see fortified on milk for kids, this idea of DHA. DHA is particularly important when your body is growing at early stages to develop brain and nervous system tissues. And your other key omega-3, EPA, is important for continuing to develop cell membranes and structure throughout the body. So these are two reasons why it's essential to have essential fatty acids in your diet for the development of your, you know, your brain and just your nervous tissue throughout the body. Things that are important for the firing of neurons and just muscular motor movement in general. Now there are other reasons why omega-3s are helpful and these are the reasons that you most traditionally see associated with them. One of the first ones is that omega-3s are particularly helpful at keeping triglycerides low. Just the property of the omega-3s, they can bind to these substances and keep them low throughout the body. The less triglycerides you have, the overall healthier your heart's going to go be. And another important reason is that omega-3s are essential which would come down to inflammatory. They are a powerful anti-inflammatory in the body and as you run, the process of running in general creates these microscopic tears, tears throughout your muscles. Omega-3s and having these essential fatty acids help inhibit the production of, of inflammatory substances which keep this in check as well.